So, Melanie Ozzy is a member of the Red Nation. She is Dene, and she's going to come up here and tell us more about the Red Nation. Yeah, hey, hi everybody. Thank you for coming out. Um, I'm just going to read a statement here. It's more of a manifesto, so that's what's going to happen. <laughs> the Red Nation formed a few months ago out of a desire to contribute to the widespread resurgence of strong, vocal, organized, and radical indigenous struggle in Albuquerque and beyond. We formed to address the marginalization and invisibility of indigenous struggles within mainstream social justice organizing and to speak out and strategically fight against the ongoing destruction of indigenous life and land. From the disproportionate violence that indigenous people experience from citizens and cops alike here in Albuquerque to the ongoing theft of indigenous water rights by big cities and corporations through so-called legal settlements to the horrifying impact of nuclear and uranium development in indigenous communities, it is clear that indigenous people must simply fight to stay alive. The Red Nation stands with all indigenous people and their accomplices in the defense of land and livelihood against this violence. And with you, with all of you, reclaims Albuquerque as an indigenous space. We are a council of indigenous and non-indigenous activists, concerned community members, students, organizers, revolutionaries, intellectuals, educators, and longtime members of the indigenous struggle who are dedicated to building a widespread movement to liberate indigenous peoples from colonialism. We do this through centering indigenous agendas, peoples, and struggles, working with allies to form coalitions to successfully engage in these struggles, and by collectively working to smash colonialism and its violence against native people in all structural and material forms. We continue a long and unfinished history of indigenous resistance by starting in our own backyard, reviving an indigenous-led movement here in Albuquerque that has been dormant for far too long. Indeed, it has been 40 years and many lives lost since an organized indigenous-led force with this kind of agenda has existed in Albuquerque. It is time to stand up again and take steps together to demand the end to a fundamentally oppressive system that affects us all by perpetuating violence against indigenous life. We ask you, Albuquerque, and the world to stand with us today and always. Thank you. Yeah. Right. Yeah.